mobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. Wobbing, 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 wobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. Hey, what is going on, fellow members of the Prank Squad? Cole here, and today I'm gonna have a serious video. It's gonna be kind of like Leafy is here. It's gonna be a rant. Um, if you guys follow us on Twitter, you saw I tweeted out this morning. Today marks the first day of Cole at camp. Um, I, originally we weren't going to make a video until Wednesday about the giveaway, but you know, something was uploaded today on the internet that is just terrible. And this video is going to be titled, as you can see, The Most Disgusting Person on the Internet. Joey Salads. Let, let me just start by saying this. Joey Salads. There must be something wrong in his, in his mind. Um, the video itself, he's done videos like this before. Other people have done videos like this before. First of all, his timing was completely off, and for those of you guys that have no clue what I'm talking about, Joey Salads made this video pretending to be, it was a social experiment, pretending Muslims are gonna, Muslims are from ISIS and they're gonna blow up something, I don't even know if they're supposed to be from ISIS, but they're supposed to be Muslims dropping a bag in front of someone, and then a Christian extremist dropping a bag. Okay, first of all, you have horrible timing because a lot of bad things have happened, there's other bombings that are going on that are not in the news because of that. I saw there was another ISIS bombing that went on. Then we have Christina Grimmy, someone who was very loved in the YouTube community who was killed by someone that was, I think he claimed ISIS. And then we have the most popular thing that is calling, like, this is like almost, I, I don't understand how he could even do this, but the Orlando shooting where like more than 50 people are killed by this ISIS extremist. This guy uses tags such as Orlando, Orlando shooting, Orlando gay nightclub, Orlando nightclub. He is using some events that are going on right now that are terrible, showing how bad the world is as tags for his video to get more views so he can make money. This by far is way too far. Joey Salads is must be insane there's something wrong with him to think he can upload this and no one's gonna give him hate he's I looked on his Twitter and he's kinda confused why everyone's hating on him because of this video I'm not confused I mean if I upload that video I would understand me being from Florida I'm highly offended because he's using the bad things that happened in my state as a way for his YouTube channel to get views I don't use things like that to get views I use things that are related to my channel, pranks, blah blah blah. That video was not filmed in Orlando. That had nothing to do with it. He's using that to get views because that's something that's going on. Say someone wants to know what happened in Orlando, they go on YouTube, because this video probably has a lot of views, that's going to be something that pops up. That is ridiculous and I'm extremely offended because the person that killed all those people lived in Florida and Florida as a state is just a shame to have someone who claimed ISIS and was an extremist and did those horrible things to those innocent people in that nightclub. And Joey Salas is using those tags to get views. That is ridiculous. I don't even understand. <sighs> Next thing I want to say is that Killer Keem star Drum Alert sent a video to him on Twitter saying he needs to take the video down. He's got wrong timing and that's completely inappropriate to be doing that right now. He tweeted at Keemstar saying, no, it's good, it's causing a political debate. So maybe he just wanted to cause a big thing and he wanted to like have like a big spike in views. The Prank Squad recently just had a big spike in views. Check our videos. We're not doing anything crazy. Check our tags. If you want, you can check our tags. We're not using things that are going on in the world. Listen, dude. I'm talking to dude. I am trying to say Joey Salas. Listen, man. Christina Grimmie was just murdered by someone that was a, that someone that was a Muslim who claimed ISIS. Then we have this night massacre that happened, and he killed over 50 people. A bunch of people were injured. They were all innocent, and he thinks, oh yeah, Orlando, Orlando nightclub, gay nightclub, Orlando shooting, as tags for the video. And if you guys want to look it up on the internet. Um, there is a bunch of tag finders where you can see what kind of tags people put on there. And you can also request those for public records uh, through YouTube. They will re request them. I bet you there's people requesting them all the time so that way it's official 
And because I bet you Joey Styles is probably going to start to come out and just say, oh yeah, well prove to me those tags are fake. So I, I personally am going to be requesting those tags because I guarantee you before the end of the night he will probably change the tags and get rid of the Orlando tags in there. And I think uh, along with all the other pranksters, this is considered mainly a prank. Social experiments are a part of pranksters' lives and prank channels. And I think all prank channels are very offended by this, and the prank squad person was very offended even because Orlando's really close to us, and it's just causing a big mass destruction to our world, and it just makes our world a worse place day by day that this stuff keeps happening. The next thing I want to say about this is that I think there are some people that responded such as Yusuf, or also known as FoosyTube, he said to take the video wrong. He is the most disgusting person on YouTube right now. We should get these people banned. I personally say we should get Joey Salads banned to teach him a lesson because he doesn't think this. He thinks this is fine. Uh, if you, I'm gonna post a picture of his Twitter right now of him saying that he thinks this is perfectly okay and how he thinks this is being a social debate. Right here, look at this. All right, here's the first tweet right here. He thinks this is like. He thinks it's okay because it's causing a political debate. Okay, whatever. You want to cause a political debate because you want to talk about... And then, right here, I'm not going to even show this one actually, but there's another tweet where he shows some conversation he had with some Muslim person and the Muslim person saying it's okay. You want to know why the Muslim person is saying it? Is They're probably supporting you because they know in reality that... Th they're living in a bad place and their people are like that. Now I'm not trying to be mean to Muslims and say all Muslims are bomb are bombers and they're terrorists, but that dude either is or he probably just know I'm not gonna even say he is, he probably knows the reality that what he was trying to say is that he was a Muslim bomber from ISIS. He used ISIS as a tag in the video. I don't even think I mentioned that. He also used the name of ISIS. The in case you guys didn't know, because of all the crazy stuff going on, ISIS also had another bombing attack I saw on the news as baby was lifted out of the rubble from an ISIS attack just this morning and it's not news because this Orlando shooting that ISIS also claims this dude like said he pledged ISIS before this isn't in the news but people could be searching up ISIS too Joey Salads you are wrong sir um please help guys please help me share this video around uh, I'm sure if there hasn't been one already, there's probably petitions going around online trying to get that video taken down or even trying to get Joey Salads, um, sorry, Joey Salads banned from YouTube. I, for one, and the Prank Squad will be signing those petitions online using the name Prank Squad because Joey Salads is completely wrong. Once again, Joey Salads, if anybody ever sees this and wonders why I'm so mad, First of all, I wasn't even going to make a video until Wednesday, so if you want to know that how mad I am, that's how mad I am. I was going to take two days off because I have camp and I'm just tired, but Joey Salads is one of the most disgusting people on YouTube for thinking that this is okay and there's nothing wrong with it. So help me share this video, guys, and we need to take down this video. We need to get him to delete it, and he needs to get banned from YouTube. He needs to stop doing these social experiments. Because there has been other videos in the past that he has done that are along the same lines, but none of them have gotten this worse. I don't think I've ever seen a video so bad in my whole entire life. And FoosyTube is actually going to be making, Yusuf Fusi is going to be making a video reacting to this. He said he's never ever wanted to make a reaction video and has never made one until now. He said this video has made him so angry he wants to make one. And I'm not reacting to it because I'm already too mad and I didn't... Alright, sorry guys, my camera died. I just want to say in conclusion, Joey Salads, you're disgusting. Um, I, don't, I don't know what's wrong with you. There's something obviously wrong with you for thinking this is okay. And I just decided real quick, guys, let me just say this. Joey Salads isn't going to get exposure from me. Not that he would get any more subscribers, but in the case that I do get big on YouTube, I don't want... Even if I get big in 20 years from now, I don't want people to say, Oh, look, he posted a tweet of Joey Salads. Let's go see who that is. Oh, yeah, let's subscribe to him. No, because Joey Salads, you should never deserve that. You should just, like, get off of YouTube, delete your whole YouTube channel, because that that just offends me as a someone that lives in Florida. That offends me as a prankster, because that's one of your little pranks. 
that just offends me on all levels and you should take that video down but anyways guys like this video if you enjoyed me talking about Joey salads go check out our website down below Twitter Instagram links in the description alright guys I'll see you guys on Wednesday for the giveaway video prank squad out yeah.